Lex is like really um eating all the time. Really pregnant and has like sensitivities. One of the things is the heat. So look at this. Like right now it's 86 degrees in here. 86 degrees. It's not like it's the heat of the day. It's 6:35 p.m. It's 6:35 p.m. It's 86 degrees. Imagine how hot it was at like 2 p.m. So we're taking the wall down. It's coming out. Yeah. This wall is coming out today, or at least partially today. We're gonna start on it. But before we do that, we got a new bed because our old bed is now uncomfortable for her. She's actually probably sleeps more on the old futon that we used to shoot reaction videos on than she does on the bed. Cause this is the old futon. Okay, it has all the bed sheets on there. But the old futon is memory foam. It's just like stuff, it's just like stuff we pieced together. <laughs> it's just a bunch of layers of foam. But that is super comfy. So she actually sleeps on there more than the bed. She'll sleep like maybe two to four hours in the bed every night. And then she'll finish her sleep on the futon throughout the day. So this is the old mattress. Oh, this is probably zipped up. Anywho, this is the old mattress. It's just a regular mattress that we got for free on Facebook Marketplace way back in 2020 when we were scavenging on the Marketplace getting a bunch of things for free. And this is the new mattress. The new one. It's a memory foam mattress, so we're gonna open it up and let it inflate and do its thing. And somehow we gotta get that mattress out. I actually take that out first. This mattress is huge. I think it's a Cali King. That's what they told us. I don't know, Cali King, King. I don't know any of that crap, but it is huge. Oh, this mattress is actually kind of nice. This is a nice looking mattress at least. It's very, very firm. Yeah, it is firm. But we were just so glad to have a free mattress. Yeah, and it's, actually, it's pretty nice. You can get a lot of nice stuff on Marketplace. But yeah, that See, thing, this is when you need brothers. That cover is from, to keep it from Watch out, Tank. Watch out. Go, Big Tanky. Mm. Oh, sh oh. We got this before we had a TV. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Dang, now how are you supposed to... See that? The fridge, he moved the fridge so we can take this wall out. Oh yeah, we didn't have the fridge right here yeah. either. Oh man, it doesn't even fit. It's taller than the door. Oh yeah, we did bring it in the other door. Yeah. yeah just do it like turn. that. Little by little. Almost. Almost. Oh, it's a Stearns and Foster bed. That's a good name brand, isn't it? Yeah. Oh. Oh. <laughs> it Almost hit. smashed Tank. He's on the couch. <laughs> hey, Tank. <laughs> Woo. I don't want to drag it across the concrete, but I guess I'm going to drag it across yeah. the concrete. I would just put it out there. <sighs> Somebody will take it, and if they don't, then we have to figure out a way to get it to the dump. Uh, the back of my truck? But it's, you think a four foot bed, you think that will fit? It's five and a half feet. <laughs> and yes, it'll fit. It's just going to be hanging out. Oh, did you hear that? Yeah. Was that thunder? Yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> well, I guess I'll take it to the dump if it gets rained on. All right. Can you shut the door behind me? Yeah. Need food. Oh. It's vacuum suit. This bed, doesn't it cost like, how much more did it cost now? Um, let me see. This is the exact bed we had when we lived in Hollywood, Florida. And it cost... It was like 80 bucks more or something. Oh, I thought it was more. That was the other bed. Yeah. Yeah, because one of these beds was like $150 more than it used to be. This one's only $80 more. That's not too bad. But that inflation is crazy. Yeah. This bed used to be under 300 bucks. Yeah. Back in the day, it was like 250. 
Want scissors? Sure. I'm gonna grab her. Give me, give me, give me, give me. I don't want to puncture the bed. Yeah. Oh, you can hear it inflating. <laughs> Yeah, that punctured a bit. <laughs> yes, I did. It's foam though, so I mean, it's not gonna hurt it. It's gonna be raggedy. Wait, it doesn't. You can't just like put the scissors. In there. I'm trying to. These scissors are super dull, so the tips oh. don't cut. There go. Whoa. What's that thing? This is gonna inflate a lot, right? It's supposed to be 10 inches? Yeah, it's gonna inflate a lot. It's looking about four inches right now. All right, now time to take out the wall. All right. Ooh. You're sweating. Look at that, look at that sweat. I'm just getting started, I still gotta do the wall. Okay, I'm That sorry. thing was heavy, that's something you're supposed to move with your bro. This wall has been the bane of my existence. <laughs> <laughs> All right, it's finally time to take this wall out. Um, we just finished the whole mattress thing. Hopefully it doesn't get random. Uh, who knows? So, um, I don't know what I'm doing, but I figure it's all gonna be pretty easy except this one part. Except this. This little socket. My plan is to put it in the ceiling. So we'll have a light switch in the ceiling. Mm, I don't know if that's a good idea or not, but I think that'll be kind of tedious, but not too terribly hard. Everything else should be pretty easy. And I'm then... just gonna attack it with a crowbar and a hammer because I'm trying not to create sawdust. So she doesn't breathe that in. And then we got to figure out what to do with the floor because I anticipate there's going to be some gaps and holes and stuff. Oh, yeah. So we're going to have to get like a rug or something. <laughs> Covered well, up. We'll figure it out when that time comes. So time to get started. It's about to be loud. I wish I had like gun range earmuffs. You want my beats by Dre? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That would probably help. It is loud. Ooh, I can listen to music. Give me your phone. Right now that I see how these are built, I probably can take the rest of it apart pretty easily. We'll see. All right, I guess this is where we end the vlog because I need to turn the electric off to finish this part up. And I can't record in the dark, so. Denied.
So we're at the doctor's this morning to get a glucose test, which means they have to draw blood um, and then test, like have me drink some sugar stuff and see if it spikes my blood sugar because my dad had diabetes. And anyway, they just want to make sure I don't have gestational diabetes. So um, I'm kind of cranky because I didn't eat that much food this morning. And I didn't sleep last night because I was waking up every two hours eating only protein and salad and stuff, but I couldn't eat carbs, um, which have been very crucial during this pregnancy so anyway now we got about 10 minutes spare we need to get inside <laughs> all right i don't know tell me man what do you know what do you know me and my boys on the road you the go she told me boy you the go like i don't know but i don't